Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our old craft where I am gathering feathers. Yes, a very important task and actually one that seriously we might be using today. But we'll get back to that. Also, I am probably going to forget that I put them in the specific backpack. Yes, my inventory is still a little bit of a mess. But in the last episode, we defeated a stage 4 dragon. And may I just say that that skull is ginormous. <laughs> That is absolutely huge. Maybe if we get a huge castle at some point, we'll be able to display all of the skulls from the slain dragons that came in our path. Um, but anyway, it is still late winter, so I am still suffering from a huge cold. Cold, And uh, there is the remainings of the battle. But before I do anything else, uh, I need to get a sleeping bag. Yes, I need to get a sleeping bag because otherwise I will get trapped outside and that is not good. All right, sleeping bag acquired. Now, we are, what's the time? Half day, uh, midday. Yeah, I think we should be fine. Now, I have been told that back at the village uh, outpost in that direction, I missed some very important pieces of, uh, well, stuff. So we're going to get over there and hopefully I'll be able to find it. Because if it is what people have been telling me, which of course I believe, then yeah, it's it's gonna be pretty good. It's gonna be really good. Now make the <clears throat> now make this jump. There we go. It was kind of nice having this stuff frozen. You can just ride across the lake. Uh, that that's pretty cool. I like that. But everything else about the the wither, I uh, wither winter. I, c I can't speak apparently today. Everything else I do not like. All right, here we are, and hopefully I'm not going to lose my horse again. So we're just going to jump in here, and there we go. Don't move. Right, so down here, if I remember correctly. Yep, right through here. Now there should be a lever somewhere around here. Uh, uh, aha, there it is. So we found this. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. This was not here last time. Wow, okay, um, apparently I missed something, uh, some very important items, some tome thing, which I'm not sure what it's going to look like. Can I shift right click these? No, I, oh, I can, okay, good. So I can check if there's anything in here other than normal books. We might want normal books, actually, so you know what, I'm gonna take all these, because who knows, we might want them for something at some point. So there we go, that is all of them taken out. Now there's of course still the walls, which I will take. But there is something else that I am apparently missing. I am not seeing what I'm missing. I've been told I'm missing things. So I'm gonna have a good look. Aha! XP tome, what's this thing? Sneak plus right click to store as much XP as possible, right click to retrieve it all. 69 out of 1395 XP stored. So that is what I've been told that I was missing. So I should have gone through all these bookshelves. And I believe I've been told that there should be two around here. So I'm gonna check every single one of these to make sure I don't miss anything. Yep, there's the second one and it's actually pretty full. It's gonna be interesting to see how many levels we're actually going to have at the end of this. I wonder if there's a third one. I mean, I've only searched half of these, so maybe, potentially. And that, I believe, is the final one. So just two, which is... I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. Shift right click to store, right click to retrieve all XP. Ooh. Ooh. And then I can shift right click to store it all in this book. You know, that's actually a really, really handy thing to have with me because that means I can store XP just, just before knowing I'm about to die. <laughs> <laughs> so that is actually not too bad at all. These are kind of nice. These are kind of... Yeah, I'll, I'll take that. Oh, I'll take that. Can I get out, please? Thank you. So that is pretty much what we were here for. And I will also go ahead and... Is there a unique one? Oh, there's a unique one. Oh, there's a unique one. Um, There's also this bounty table, which... I still don't know if we are in... Good enough of a position to be able to utilize, but let's see. Right click you. There we go. Halfway there to be able to summon these Ignises and. I I was not Ignises. I I I I Aegis? Aegis? I, I don't know. I don't know, but we can summon these guys and they can help us fight. So that is going to be very handy. But they're also loud, so I'm going to ride away into the sunset. But yes, so thank you to everyone who told me that I was missing the XP tomes. 
I would have probably never found these unless I actually needed some books, which, uh, to be honest, I might have not even remembered to go back and get those. So, yeah, thank you very much. And we're home just in time for night time, which is awesome. Now, I should mention that, of course, in the last episode, well, again, we defeated the stage 4 dragon, but that also means that we have ourselves a dragon egg. But, uh, I need to remember how on earth to hatch them and also how I'm going to do it because I may I, I'm able to hatch it like in here but it has to grow before I can actually fly it and so I need a big enough area but also a big enough area that is secure for the dragon to to grow up and well with the possibility of having world events like we have experienced before I am not sure where the safest place to do that or the safest method to do that is so I'm still figuring that out but if you guys have any suggestions feel free to let me know down below in the comments now when I use this that is 21 levels I think I'm going to upgrade attack or am I that's a good question I think attack is going to be the next thing that I do um, <laughs> I could also start taking some of these things, but I think I need the requirements in order to take them. So, yeah, I'm going to do that very, very close to getting the next levels, but I'm going to keep this on me so I can always use it at all times. Obviously, if I die, the XP is still there. Um, we are also going to delete this marker. This dragon is still here, but I actually want to go back to that area because I saw something that I recognize from my first time playing. Oh, it's early spring! It's early spring! Yay! Oh, that's so nice. That is really, really lovely. I hope that means my crops are going to grow again because I missed my wheat farm. But speaking of XP, there's this thing. Level up. <clears throat> Hold on. Give me just a. Yep. Level up reloaded, and I can choose one of these three. Uh, get plus XP from ore from mining ore, plus XP from crafting, or plus XP from mobs. I feel like I already get XP from mobs, so obviously I would get more XP from mobs, so I feel like that would be nice, but I also feel like crafting would be nice, so I'm, I don't know which one to take. I actually don't know which one to take. I'm gonna do crafting. I think. Or mobs. Nah, let's do mobs. What else is it? Okay, so we have here, so combat, this is the one I have chosen. Crafting, I have not chosen that, and I don't think I have the levels or what I need to do it. But I do have this, and that means I can start spending things. So random crits, for example, archery, don't know what that does. Draw a bowstring back faster, that's very cool. Stealth, sneaking it decreases mob detection range. Okay, that's a nice buff. Shields block unblockable damage occasionally, that's nice. Iron skin, stealth damage, arrow speed. This is very nice stuff. This is very nice stuff indeed. Random crits, melee damage. Maybe crafting would have been better. Cooking speed. Green thumb. Fishing proficiency. Mining. Increases stone harvesting speed. Okay, I'm not really interested in using levels on that right now, but that is really cool to know. So I, I need to remember to use that. But... Uh, actually, horse, you're not coming with me because this is actually going to be a little bit dangerous. Simply due to the fact that we have the other dragon nearby. Before we do that, though, hold on. There is ice and fire. There is a... I just remembered I'm all over the place here and I do apologize. But you can make... Uh, that's not it. Yes, dragon meal. These dragon meals... Uh, so we can use... Ooh, okay. We can basically use these dragon meals to speed up the the growth of dragons. So if I could make a ton of that, that might make the issue that I was saying before a little bit less of an issue, if I can make enough of it, that is. I need to make a farm out of those guys, really, to be... Yeah, that, that would be ideal. But anyway, we're coming up on this area now. Um... I could take up the fight with this dragon that is over here, but it, yeah, that one, but I don't... No, it's actually right where we need to go. I need to go there. I think I know what that is. But... Do I really want to... You know, I have the bolts for it. I have the bolts. I have the skill. 
I am I I'm oh game freeze. I might as well get it done. I might as well get it done. Gonna make this area that much more secure and safer to roam around in. Let's see here. We got my bronze strengthened crossbow and one and a half stacks of bolts. I think that should do it. Hopefully anyway. Also Ooh! Look at the water. Maybe I can grow my potatoes now. Or carrots. I don't know what those are. <laughs> anyway, back to it. It's so nice being out of the winter now. It's really lovely. But next time, next time we're closing in on winter, I have preparations to make. <laughs> Some serious preparations, because I'm not dealing with what I have been having to deal with this winter. Alright, well, you guys know the drill. I'm just going to stand here and I'm going to shoot this dragon. Uh, hopefully... I'm not going to miss any of my shots. Hopefully it's not going to come towards me. Uh, yeah, this is going to take a while, so I'll be back when the job is done. You, you, you guys have seen this plenty of times now, so... <laughs> it's fine. Whoa. What the... what? On Earth? Why is it so close? Not the thunder, but the dragon, but also the thunder. <laughs> oh. Good job, me. There we go. Mission successful. Right through the trees. Right by the lake. Perfect. Mission accomplished, and we didn't even use a stack of bolts. That is the victory that I like to see. Also, for some reason right here, my FPS is... Quite bad. I don't know... Oh. I was wondering why my FPS was low. Those reflections would explain it. Well, I, uh, I, I turned it off and it, it didn't do anything. Anyway, let's ignore that and let's get over to the dragon. Yeah, this is a much, much smaller than the one we killed in the previous episode. Also, I'm slowly getting hypothermia here, actually. I need to be careful. I don't have a way to light a fire, which is not ideal. But here it is. Let us... I don't have any bottles. Getting some ice dragon blood would be good. Oh, well. We'll probably find more as we go along. But there we go. Yep, that was a stage three. Much more manageable than the bigger one from last episode. Please let me sleep. All right, it is morning. And now we can check out this. Because if I... In my last series, I lived in one of these. And by living in one of these, I mean that the stuff underneath this thing. Only question is how we access it. At least I think there's going to be uh, something underneath it. Because there was when I last found one of these and it was, um, well, it, it, it was floating. So it was a little bit more accessible. I wonder if I can break through the ice here. Oh, I can. And it's water underneath, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Also very bad, because now I... Oh, I can't actually get up now. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh, I can't drown here. That's really bad, actually. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit in trouble. This is not good. Also, it just means I'm going to be freezing a lot more. Okay. Well, at least I can do this now. Yeah, hypothermia. I know. I know. Okay, it keeps, keeps appearing. I need to get some... Dicks or something to light a campfire. These three fall faster. Oh, I have my XP tome. I can put my levels in. There we go. Good stuff. Uh, got the sticks. Got the sticks. Hypothermia is gone for now because we're active, but I'm going to have to place this right here. Okay, good. Enough sticks. Oh, and healing right next door. So that's wonderful. A little bit of uh, breakfast. Maybe. Uh, where's the sun at? Uh, at I don't know. The, the, Noon, po post noon, lunch, something. I don't know. Anyway, we're going to dig through this. Uh, I think digging through it right here is gonna be good. Maybe. I just, I just remember this being a thing, like that being something down here. But I may be wrong. I may be completely, completely wrong. This is not a good sign. Not gonna lie. Oh no, my campfire is gone. Oh dear. Well, may maybe that's. Nothing down here. Maybe there's nothing. I just thought there would be. Because I thought I recognized it. I th thought I really, really did recognize it. But apparently... 
I did not. One last stick right here in the water. Which is a really bad idea because I can drown this way. <laughs> um, yeah. I don't think there's anything down here. Nope. I thought there would be a house with loot and everything underneath this, but apparently not. Well, that was... That was a, both a disappointment and also time wasted and a campfire wasted. <laughs> I may while I'm here, though. Yeah, I may, I may grab these ores right here. Because, uh... Can never have too much of this stuff. I mean, look at all the iron here. It would be a shame to just leave it behind. And yes, I'm taking my distance, because last time I mined one of these, a, a creature popped out of nowhere, and it wasn't a pleasant uh, experience. Well, I guess we can take the map and we can cross off the dragon there. So, now, a couple of episodes back, <laughs> we found a battle tower in this area with another dragon guarding it. And I think, now that we're in spring, we're not as cold and as miserable. Uh, <laughs> I think we can take it on because I really want access to the battle tower due to the spawners, due to getting the XP when destroying the spawners and also of course the loot that are in it. So I think we should head over there and scout it out at the very least to begin with. Also, I don't know if we have melons. Do we have melons? I don't know if we do. What are we doing now? Some frozen melon. Oh, I could eat that. Frozen melon. Mm. Oh, wait a minute. There's two. There's one here and one there. I could totally breed them. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I assume they take wheat. If they do, I'm totally going to lure them over here. They're probably going to be free range because I'm not going to bother chopping down that many... Hey, buddy. Chopping down that many trees just to make a fence. But then again, they could easily get hurt. But if they're free range, they might be more secure. Anyway, I hope they take wheat. Oh, there's even three, actually. But two is all we need. All right. Do you take wheat, buddy? Do you take wheat? You looked at me funny when I pulled out the wheat. Come on. Are you gonna follow me? Hmm. That's a no. But you do eat it, I assume, right? Because you do look at me very hungry. Yes. Okay. Okay, good. There are more than one way of luring an animal. Uh, no, one of them is not getting regenerated, but I, I would like to get regenerated anyway. It is going to be a little bit expensive, this, and I don't really know if it's going to be worth it. But I think so. I think it will. I, I hope it will. Of course, we're gonna do this the old-fashioned way. Horse and a lasso. Well, it's a lead, but we're, we're going to call it a lasso. All right, buddy, come on. Come on. You're going to get a friend. Stop being lonely on top of that hillside. It's dangerous anyway. All right, I think we're going to keep these guys behind here, behind the trees. A nice shade. Nice a lot of grass. Uh, where did my lead go is the question. I don't see my... Where's my lead? I right-clicked it and the lead popped off, and I don't know where it is, and now I'm dancing around this thing. Maybe it's a one-time use? Nope, that is. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Take two. Yeah. Uh, okay. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What? Take three. And jump over the river. There we go. Definitely got that the first time. And jump up. There we go. Lead you over. And jump. There we go. Perfect, get the lead broke. The lead broke. That is getting me wet and cold for nothing. Come on now. Get over here to your friend. See? See? You have friend! Friend! Okay, can I get the lead now? Can I? There we go. Right. Don't tell me you're no. Oh, now you follow me. Okay, well, that's lovely. Right, now please do what I want you to do. Yes! Farmable! Farmable! Love it! Perfect! Hopefully they're safe. <laughs> Alright, now it's bedtime. Right after storing our loot, not too bad. I don't know why I'm keeping all this dragon stuff in a backpack. It's not like I'm just gonna, eh, let me bring all my dragon stuff with me. We did in fact not have any melons in here. Good to know! 
All right, I think we have everything that we are going to be requiring on this journey. Time to sleep and then head out to the location. Yeah. Oh, that would have been more dramatic if I could enter that bed like that, but... Oh well, still early spring, early in the morning, day 83. I'd say, I'd say we're doing pretty good for it, actually. The, the pro RL craft players are probably looking at this as... Uh, not good progress, but consider considering I'm playing, I'm going to call this pretty good progress. Now, taking a look at this. Yeah, we need to go straight, then hit a dragon. No, just follow this-ish. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine. Hmm. Already encountered a lake and a lag spike. That is not my idea of fine, but I guess we'll work with it. Aha, uh -huh, still crossable. Please don't break as we're crossing this. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff. What are you? Oh, you're crap. Okay, you're, you're fine. Why is the ice melting now? <laughs> it was so much easier to navigate before. Um, uh, maybe over here. Go over here and then. Yeah, yeah, it's perfect. Okay, and then we need to cross these mount this mountainous area. Ooh. Oh, cool ravine with trees and everything underneath it, uh, in it. I don't need to, I don't need that. Let's just get up here. There we go. Oh, we're heading into a cold biome again. Ugh. Don't like that. Now we need to go up towards this direction. That's a tall mountain. That's a very tall mountain. That's a very nice and very tall mountain. Wow, these are some cliffs. Wow. Uh, right, I need to... How on earth am I supposed to keep going? Uh, oh, wait a minute, what's that? Oh, we found another battle tower, ladies and gentlemen. We found another battle tower. Uh, where, where is it? Oh, there's a siren right next to it. Battle tower. There's a siren right next to it, though. That... I'm so happy that I, that I saw that. Because that could have been catastrophic going down there. Okay, uh, well, there's another battle tower down there. However, I'm not going to go to that one because there's a siren. I'll need to deal with that another time. I need to refresh my memory on how to defeat them the best. Of course, I could wear earplugs, but that is not my idea of fun because then I can't protect my helmet. My helmet? My, my head. Ow. Sorry, horse. All right, so we're going all the way back down to... <laughs> We went on such a detour there. What? Oh, I thought that was a dragon. No, oh, don't, don't come towards me. Don't come near me. <laughs> I'm going to pretend that that fire is old. Because I have no registered dragons in the area. Um, so yeah, that, that's going to be from old battles. Yes, still raging on. You know, even though we've been in a cold biome for quite a bit now, sorry horse, then we're actually not super cold. It could actually be a lot worse. Oh, hey llamas. Right, we're nearing the area, so what I'm going to do is... I remember there's some sort of house area over here. Yeah, that's that, and... I think I should be able to see the dragon from now. Just going to up the end the distance a little bit. And we should see a battle tower at some point. Uh, the ruins there. I mean, I've locked it to be over here, so maybe I'm being scared too early. Yeah, that's the battle tower. That's the battle tower right there. And there's another very interesting looking tower right there. But then, as we get closer, I'm fairly certain... Yeah, look at that. That's dragon evidence right there. I just don't see it, which is nerve-wracking. There's another barn thing over there. I remember entering that house. But right now I don't see the dragon, but the fire is right there, so it has been in this area. Let me put my horse... Over here. Granted, this area is safe. Uh, can I... Hmm. I was hoping I could get the horse in there. Well, that's one way of doing it. That is breaking this. Breaking that. Opening this. 
breaking this very, very slowly. Going through this. Ow. Ow. Surprisingly, my hurt, my head didn't get hurt. There we go. You stay there, horsey. Because this is going to be a dangerous job, because I don't know where this dragon is. I just remember not going to the battle tower, because the dragon was too close. And would start coming towards me if I went to the tower. And last time I was here, I went back home to get my crossbow and bolts. And then we were attacked by a stage 4 dragon that came out of nowhere, so... Yeah, that's that story. We're back here now. Uh, where is it? I'm scared entering this area because I know the fire. That's a lot of fire over there. I mean the dragon is... Yep, that is. Hello. Dragon has be clearly been here. Um, I'm way too close in my opinion. But I will get some shots in if I can. I can always run away. Hmm. Get closer. Oh, not too close, not too close. You need to be within the rendering area of being able to see the dragon get back. <laughs> if I'm too close, then that's going to be bad news for me. And all the sheep around me, actually. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm gonna do this. Uh, I'll be back when this has been dealt with. Oh, hello, zombie. Ooh, I might be triggering this bonus in there. Uh, you're not one I need to deal with right now. Zombie head, I'll take that. Uh, okay, it's coming over, it's coming over. It's annoying the way they just cut out of rent distance. Wait, hold on. What was that? Whoa! Okay, that's interesting. And also mildly horrifying. One thing I just remembered, we didn't at all loot the other dragon nest that we killed earlier in the episode. So that's probably something I need to remember to do. Not sure this is exactly where I would love to spend the night with a dragon right next doors. Wait, I think I can move. I think I can make it. Move back. Yep. Got it. Haha. <laughs> Maybe get one last shot in before bedtime. Oh, well, it missed. Yep, there we go. There we go. Now you're gonna despawn. Yep, there we go. Now I take my chance to sleep. There we go. At long last. Still didn't use an entire stack of bolts, but... What's that? Okay, I thought that was another battle tower. But we still made it. We got it and was victorious yet again. I just have to jump through this. Yeah, that... Ugh, that's some damage. I don't even know where it landed. I don't even know where it's home. Oh, it's home was right here. Okay, yeah, that, that would explain things. Eh, get up. All right, well, this place is now officially safe. Ish. Safer. <laughs> right, let us see what we get. Uh, of course, from the chest, but also the dragon. I might not take everything that I get from, see from these chests because I don't know. Ooh, 10 levels. That's not bad, just keep an eye out for other dragons. We have had some that are close to each other. Uh, I think I need to... There we go, hold down shift. Let's see what we get from you, pal. And what size of dragon were you? That's the question, we can see that from the skull. Save three, I'll take it. 24 scales, yep, pretty good stuff. I'm happy with that. That's weird, but all right, let's go through these chests real quick. I'll take emeralds, I'll take books. Not gonna take the armor. I'll take manuscripts and bones because we can make bone meal. Um, other than that, though, I don't think. And our iron ingots, of course. But I'm not gonna fill my inventory with armor. I'll take obsidian as well. <laughs> Just because then I don't have to deal with getting it. Uh, cobwebs. Also very useful. My inventory is already full. I don't like this. Gold, uh, gold ingots are good too. Oh, and then the iron ingots. My inventory is already full. Inventor oh, and diamonds, of course, diamonds. Uh, uh, yeah. mm. Okay, this is a lot of stuff, actually. This is not bad. You know, I really wish the backpacks could car be carried while you are wearing armor. I really wish that was a thing, and that I didn't have to give up a chest plate 
for it. However, I know it is change. I know it's changeable in the config. I just feel like then we're we're changing the way our old craft was meant to be played if it's not officially changed from the mod pack. Um, so, oh, I can actually do this. Get some extra points for that. Uh, so I'm not actually going to change it, even though I really really want to. Right, I'm not going to loot this entire battle tower. I will mark it on the map, and I might just take a peek inside. Battle tower. Oh, good job, me. Take that battle tower, take two. There we go, done. Uh, I might take a peek inside. I might take a quick peek, see what we got. We also have that that I want to look at, but... I... Oh, there's water in here. Hmm. Do I have any building blocks? I don't really, but I do have a tree. Oh, blazes. Hold up. That could be good. That's actually really good. Hold on. If I search heating thing, heating apparatus. Yes. For winter, anyway. Okay, well, let's check this out first. I do have a water bucket, so that's good. Uh, right. Yeah, I don't really have the space in my inventory to deal with this. So... Just gonna take a quick peek. Quick peek. Oh, I don't have any fire resistance or anything either. Uh, well, hello. No, change to Einstein bow. Oh no, that's bad. That's bad. Oh, I could actually just do that. Oh no, nope. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. <laughs> I didn't think that went through. Didn't think that went through one bit. I need to get rid of the spawners. Oh, I know where one of them is. Okay. You know what? Hmm. What might be better is doing this. My bow is pretty powerful, so I should be able to clear this pretty quickly. Like that. But I would love to get the blaze rods, though. Like that. Get this one. Get that one and get this one oh, but they spawn so quick oh okay that's a, a rare thieving blaze of something um maybe this is not the best idea yeah that's a special one oh but it's half health though and you're dead right i'm gonna run in there i'm gonna run in get the spawners get the spawners get the spawners. Okay, there's just one blaze spawner, actually. Hold up. That's one blaze spawner. And... Break, please. Broken. Broken. Got it. Got it. Now I just need to clear it. The rest is cave spiders, and I don't think they'll spawn because it is too... Right. Good. Good stuff. There we go. Oh, hello. You guys... Uh, snipers, apparently. Oh, hello. There's another one over there. And... Die! Good. Break you. I hear stuff walking, which is not ideal. <laughs> this is scary! I see stuff underneath. Oh, wait, hold on. My shield, my shield. I feel like I hear a bow. Priming. That's because I am. <laughs> oh. I really, really cannot die here. Yep. 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 This is my cue to leave. My cue to leave. I think my cue to leave. Uh, but there's place rust down there. That I really, really, really do want to need. <laughs> Don't have any building blocks. Oh! Oh, you're coming up! How kind of you? Oh, are you kidding me? What on earth are you doing here? You're not supposed to be out. Not at this time of day. Well, I want that blaze rod, so... Going down. Oh, there's another one here! Got that. There's another one right there. Ooh! Okay, maybe coming down here was a good idea. I can shoot you. I need to be careful of the skeleton, though. As always. Got the blaze. Have plenty of arrows. So it should be good. Clear it, clear it, clear it. We're good. We're good. 
Destroy the spawners. Got that. Shoot it before it shoots me. Got it. That was a ba- ooh, diamond. Pretty sure that was a baby zombie that just <laughs> appeared out of nowhere. Let's destroy it. I had another boat priming. Yep. Pro Ow, that was bad. That could have been that could, could have been game over the right there. So dangerous. Ooh, that could have been bad too. Oh, that's multiple, 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 multiple. And the sun is going down. This is, a, this, is a, this is a tough battle. I would say this is tougher than the dragons. Um, yeah, when I do this tower fully, probably a good idea to sleep or set my spawn point. In one of the nearby houses. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> My mouse. What on earth? Okay, I'm out. I'm definitely out. <laughs> okay, that was a special one. I thought I could get it in time, but I couldn't. Please. Nope. Okay, I'm out of arrows as well. I'm sorry, chicken, but... Yep. Got it. Okay. And it's night time. And it's night time. Night time. Okay, so something else special. Okay, I think that's just regening. Right, where did I leave my horse? Over here. Get me... Is this the one? Ah, oh, wait, hold on. This is not the one that I put my horse in. Oh, wait, it is. It just has another door. <laughs> oh, dear me. Right, guys, I'm going to call this an episode. I need to get home. I think I'm going to do that off camera. Get situated here. I need to uh, clear some things out. Organized inventory and whatnot. I think I'll bring a bed. Actually, there's already a bed here, so I'll set my spawn here. And then in the next episode, we're probably going to take down that uh, that battle tower and whatnot. Um, probably going to bring a backpack as well, just to make things easier. But yeah, overall, I'd say that that was a pretty good, a successful run. Uh, I will go ahead and upgrade attack to 16, so we can now use diamond gear, so that's nice. We got some diamonds, so we might make some of that in the next episode as well. But guys, I hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new and enable those notifications so you don't miss the next episode. And I hope to see you in the next one. Until then, have a wonderful day and goodbye. Stop.